say, can it with the same say? Yeah, I don't care what C C or E say. Or he say or she say, money in a briefcase. Nigga must be feeling cause I'll get in that cheese. Oh, that's a scummy bitch. Oh, I think that bitch is TK. Oh, she gon' learn today. I tell that bitch to do a three-way. If you feelin' lucky, I might go in for the sweep step. I be in this blunt, like I smoke on all MPJ. And then like on M Canal, I'm a fucker in my PJs. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Vontae the first back again with another Jujutsu Kaisen manga reaction, chapter 247. We here. We are here. I'm scared. I am very scared. I'm terrified. Sukuna is just ridiculous. So last chapter we obviously seen everybody trying to jump and fight Sukuna's Jujutsu jumping Kaisen. Jujutsu Kaisen. You already know how it is. Uh Higuruma ends up getting early. Well, we seen from the cliffhanger from the prior chapter. Sukuna got out of the domain because of the tool and whatnot. And then uh, Kusakabe ends up coming in and protecting Higuruma from Sukuna's dismantle, which is dope. Because with, within the same week, we seen uh, Kusakabe block the uh, Uzumaki from Kenjaku too. So that was fire. Um, and yeah, everybody's trying to jump. Eno got uh, my boy Nanami's cleave and shit. They, they, they out here trying to box. They trying to box. So, uh, Yuji, Chozo got impaled and shit by Sukuna. I'm like, God damn, bro. I'm terrified though. Because Higuruma at the end of the chapter, even though he's showing some very impressive feats right now, I think he ends up using domain amplification at the end of the chapter. So he's looking pretty nice. Even the narration say like, this man is like someone in the same realm of Gojo, rivals Gojo or something. Gege said it, the narration said it. So there's that. Also, too, before I even get into this reaction, uh, pull up tomorrow for the last episode. So, Jujutsu Kaisen Season 2, Episode 23, pull up for that because we're going to be doing that. And then we'll be back to just doing manga content. We got to wait, but you already know this next episode is going to be nice. Nice cliffhanger, I, I'd assume. And next season going to be fire, too. So, pull up if you want to support your boy. But we're here for the manga right now, so let's get into the manga like we supposed to, all right? Domain, ampli uh, domain Amplification Reignited. Would intrigue Sukuna even more than that was the, the interruption caused by domain amplification and the subsequent resumption of his techniques effect. The genius Higuruma, what is it of his talent that shines so brightly? And chapter, of course, the decisive battle in the inhabited demon infested Shinjuku part 19. God damn, Gege don't give a fuck about titles. I know there's a lot of mangaka nowadays. I feel like they don't, they really don't give a fuck about the titles for real. This is a dope panel. That's a dope ass panel. I spit a little bit on my hold on, man. <laughs> but this is a dope ass panel. You see the top half of Sakuna's face, like where his eyes and like his nose, and then the bottom is his, his mouth and his chin and shit. That's fire. I like how Gay yeah, did that. That was fire. When activated amplification in my fight with Gojo Satoru, I paid close attention to to only pause and not invalidate Maharaga's adapt adaptation. Hmm. Mm-hmm. He too, he too is managing to keep his sword alight between amplifications. There's no doubt about it. The man is working with a profoundness of his ability at a similar level to me. That is ridiculous. So he's able to balance that, like, use domain amplification and also go back to his his technique. It's, that's something that we don't see often in the series at all. Like, characters, like, going constantly back and forth between things that would work and things that won't work. So, like, going back to when... Um, like Jogo and Hanami, when they were using domain amplification, they had to like stop. Or Hanami stopped, and then they didn't. And then she like she didn't have it covered around her, so she ended up getting fucked up by, fucked up by Gojo because she was using her curse technique. But in this case, Sukuna and uh, Kus I must say Kusakabe, Sukuna and uh, Higuruma, they're able to go in between, and that's that's dope. I like that. I like that. What I have noticed, even though Sukuna is hella OP. Everybody that's fighting him has some kind of interesting thing going on. You know, there's always something for somebody. And that's what I like. It makes Sukuna is still him. You know, don't get a fuck. They'll be still him. But they're also doing a great job, too. And I like that. You know, even if it doesn't mean nothing in the end, they get killed or something, they still show some kind of shine. And I think that's the point that we're getting here, too, with Sakuna's dialogue. Let me continue, though, because I'm, I don't know, I'm just excited and I'm liking what I'm reading so far. Anyway... Gege says, Happy New Year. I look forward to another great year with you all. You too, my boy. Higuruma Hiromi, right? Oh, shit. Oh, he's about to use domain expansion. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. Nigga's toes spread out and shit. That's fire, though. And then he gets to, well, he gets to do, like, different hand signs and shit because he got four arms. So he gets, like, that's crazy, though. I like that. But it's, it's... Ooh, Higuruma and Sukuna. I mean, Sukuna. Yuji, they both. Oh, shit. Boom. 
okay, we're falling, shit broke. Ah, I like this panel. You see Yuji falling, and you see Sakuna falling. I like that. That's cool. The juxtaposition between the two. Higuruma's that is he dashing towards Sakuna? Okay. He got I think he got the sword in his hand. Uh oh, his eyes. Oh shit, what's about to happen? Ooh, Yuji comes in. Ooh, and he about to punch the shit out of Sakuna. Okay. Nice. Nice. Oh, Sakuna blocked. God damn it. He blocked the shit. It's always fire seeing Yuji against Sakuna. This is really fire to see. Like, and the thing I like about Jujutsu Kaisen, everything is so fast. It's like, and I know some people say that they don't like it because they, they want some downtime. And I can agree for certain instances, I think early on this season, uh, or not in the season, the series that, that makes sense then. But every since Shibuya, everything is on go. Everything is on go. And I like that Sakuna and Yuji, they don't have no, like, relationship. He just shared the body with them, and that's it. They're like roommates that had nothing in common. They didn't even like each other, but they had to room together. That's basically what they are. Now they boxing. Look at this shit. <laughs> oh, shit. This nigga used this mantle on Yuji. Fuck. Or did he use Cleave? I always get them mixed up. I ain't gonna lie. I, I know I know which one does what. Which one? Like, one is for the curse energy. Other is not. I get it. But, like, when I see the slashes, I don't... I, I be forgetting. But, anyway... Take a good look in the mirror, brat. Oh my god. Nigga play tic-tac-toe on this nigga's body, bro. You were a bore. Why does he... It's like, for some reason, Sakuna just don't ever want to acknowledge Yuji. He acknowledges every, literally everybody else but Yuji. Like, what the fuck, bro? <laughs> like, you don't find him a little a little interesting. Like, this nigga's a little... Like, he's tanky. Like, you don't find him a little... Like, come on, bro. I get it. You, you insult anybody you want to, but come on, bro. There isn't a single interesting bone in that body. You see what I mean? Why does he... It's like he tries hard to, like, to... And maybe that's Gege making us, like, feel satisfied when Yuji does, you know, beat his ass. But, like, he don't give him no acknowledgement, like, at all. I mean, I know he already he already said, like, it was weird what... uh. Kenjaku did with this with this brat, you know how he created him and shit. But like, you don't find him a little bit interesting. And that's the same thing though with Kenjaku with Choso though. It's a similar thing. Like you don't find him interesting. But I'm like, how not? Like out of all your creations, I mean, he's literally the best aside from Yuji. Like, but I don't know. They just be talking. These niggas is not satisfied with shit. God damn, he went crazy though. Ooh, he could. Oh, he trying to. He using that like a fucking. What you call him? The shit he, when they fence with them kind of swords. He trying to get him, but Sukuna is dodging the absolute fuck out of that. Okay, he's running, boom, uppercut it, Higuruma, god damn. And for Higuruma to be so new to this, this is fire. This nigga's new. Imagine if he has experience under his belt with this shit he got going on. He'll be one of the most insane sort. He already is. But, like, imagine. And he's smart. This nigga would have been a problem for Sukuna. I mean, he kind of is right now. That's why Sukuna's going so damn hard against him, but... Shit. Scale of the dragon. Ooh. Ooh. This is a dope panel, too. I like that. Recoil. Oh, shit. Twin meteors. Oh, my God. Oh, wow. I forgot. Did Was it in the last chapter? We did see something. Did they ask about... Oh, somebody had a question about how Sukuna was using them flames. Was it Kusakabe? Somebody did, but... Nigga. To twin meteors, nigga. What are you talking about? You doing that flame shit again? Dismantle. What the fuck? What does he do? What is his curse technique? Is this curse technique like? I don't know, man. Does he like trace things or something? Like, is he tracing over stuff? Like, think about the flame arrow and then this, and obviously just the regular dismantle and cleave. Did he just like trace shit? And then it just. Like, like any any slash that he does, shit, like, whatever it is, shit, just, I don't know, man, I don't know. Still don't know. What the fuck is in that black box, nigga? Ooh, God. Flame. Like, what the fuck else is in there? Heal yourself. Nigga, that's a crazy thing. Heal yourself. Usually niggas say kill yourself. Niggas say heal yourself. Go on and try. Oh, my God. He sliced his fucking arm off. Go on. This nigga is really interested in this nigga. He said try. Try to heal. Try to use re reverse curse technique. He is really fascinated from this nigga. That's a crazy way to find out and be fascinated in the person and see if they can do some shit. It's like somebody throwing, I mean, well, they do do that. Throw babies or like kids in the water and see if how to swim. Kind of like that. But this is just obviously the way, like, nigga cut off his fucking arm. Like, what the fuck? I am new to this shit, gang. 
It's laughable, really. No matter how cold-hearted I become, no matter how thorough my, my resolve, the pain is still as clear as day. Is this as far as you go? Oh my, he chopped off his fucking arms. Both, well, both arms or both hands, wrist, forearm, forearm down. And then he slashed his legs too. Did he slash his legs off or did he just slash them? I think he just slashed them. Next is your head. You'll need reverse curse technique to, you know that, don't you? Come on, give it your best shot. Otherwise, it's the end of the line for you. This thing is so wild, bro. This is one of the most terrifying antagonists ever. Because whether he's amused with you, like how he is with, with Higanuma, or whether he's bored of you, like how he is with Yuji or anybody like that, it's dangerous both ways. If someone were to ask you, what's Sukuna, like say you were just a sorcerer, what kind of, what side of Sukuna would you want to fight? The one who is amused by you or the one who is bored of you? I don't know, because the bored one, nigga just want to end you quick. Or he can play with you if you want to. And then the amused one, he's going to do shit like this. This thing is trying to test out his might. He's trying to test his might. Telling, hey, use reverse. Heal yourself, bro. Nigga, your arms cut off. Nigga, your head's next, bro. You heal yourself now. Bro, no, bro, I can't. <laughs> I think I should play my role to its completion and die in this fight. Mm. They did ask him, though, like, are you, are you willing to die in this fight? Plus, he already was on that because of the whole law shit, him as a lawyer and shit. So, my role, so just like usually, my role... Oh shit, what's about to happen? Ooh. So this one to get his hand shot or some shit? This is that older brother. Oh, that was oh, I didn't even realize that was uh piercing blood from Charles. Though. This is that older brother, the death uh the death wound painting. So stubborn. Oh, he could only got an open Oh he used did he use reverse curse thing? He did. I think he did. His arms are back. And you see the smoke. Wow. I don't think it's is it as good? I don't know. But he's, he is getting it back, though. Oh, he's about to stab. He's about to stab. He's 100% about to stab. He stabs Sukuna in the hand. Nice. At least he got him, though. Ooh. Nice shot, I suppose. Oh, my God. Why is he saying shit like that? Stop, bro. Did he grab this nigga body? Oh, fuck. His, he severed his own hand. Oh, he's. I didn't even repeat that he did. Wow. Wow, hopefully he's that still attacking that hand does something. Uh, it's not, it's not, because he severed his own shit before he pierced it. Wow, GG's, bro. Curse is getting stronger post-mortem. I wouldn't call it impossible. Curse is on. Um, if anything, I'd say that, that would, uh, if anything, I'd say that would match our general understanding of curses more accurately. My role, Ooh, Yuji's right behind Sakuna. Oh, he just slashed this nigga in half. He gonna win a half. Oh my god. Can, can we still use that sword though? Cause we can still use the sword. We'll be good. I think we can still use the fucking sword. I think. I hope. Fuck. But but Yuji's right behind Sakuna. He about to Damn. Bro is gone. Wow, his hand. Oh, I love this panel and Yuji's eyes, Higuruma's eyes. Another mentor of Yuji is a uh, biting the dust, man. Or getting out of commission, like with Toto. Toto was, um, you know, with him, but Nanami, Toto, Gojo, like, this nigga, shit, Yaga, it, he has so many mentors that just get body, bro. Nanami, Gojo, Toto, yeah, everybody, bro. Now Higuruma, and Higuruma is really one of the, the lower end mentor, because he's not, he kind of is a mentor, because he's like, he's older than them, and he's, he's wise, and he helped them out, so, damn. Uh, the only last mentorish role is Choso, and Choso's, uh, I mean, he already got saved a few times, so we'll see what happens, but damn, man, you've got it from, oh, I was just talking about Nanami and shit, you got it from here, it's just like Nanami, bro, Higuruma gave me, that's why Higuruma, he jumped up my character when he got introduced, he reminded me of Nanami, he filled in that void, I love that Gege is aware of the comparisons, I mean, I know that's probably what Gege intended, but like, damn, bro. It's just like that again. I've done what I can. At least he smiled, though. I am a Jujutsu sorcerer. Wow. Oh, and Yuji got the little the little last essence of the fucking sword. He about to stab this nigga Sakuna in the back. Bro, please. Oh, we're going to go on break for a while, too. It's going to be a minute. Damn. Grasping the curses entrusted to him with his own hands. Wow. 
Yuji, you have to do your thing, dog, big dog. Yuji's my guy, bro. You got to. Oh, it's going to be so good to see Yuji just finally get his moment to just end shit. End shit his way. Like, it's all about being a Jujutsu Sorcerer. I like that Higuruma accepted that. Like, yeah, I'm a Jujutsu Sorcerer, man. I did my role. And he even smiled and said, you got it from here, pal. Just like with uh, Nanami, man. This is dope. Wow. Damn, man. Good ass chapter, man. Good ass chapter. Ooh, I want to see what happens next week. Ooh, I need to see it now, bro. I need to see it now. Oh, boy. I'm scared, though, because that means Eno, Kusakabe, and them niggas is next. Them niggas is next. <laughs> That's all I'm going to say. Choso, I think he'll still, he'll still be around a little longer because since he has more a relevant role for, you know, with Yuji being his brother and shit. But, like, yeah, you know, you're done. And Kuzakabe, is he, if he's done, then, yeah, it's, it's going to be tough. Maki, you better come up out of nowhere here. We need you here. I don't know where you at. I don't know if you're a Utah or not. But, Maki, please, we need help. Let's, let's, let's go double team Sukuna again. Just like y'all, you and Yuji did before, not too long ago. So, oh, man. Dope ass chapter. Let me know down below what you guys thought about my reaction to chapter itself. Any predictions for the next chapter? R.I.P. Higuruma, bro. Goaded, bro. He's so goaded, bro. Damn. Ah. Uh. Let me know down below how you guys feel, bro. See you guys on the next video. Come back tomorrow for the Jujutsu Kaisen Season 2, Episode 23. See you guys there. And...